I like the so, the so many different mixes of music in here, man. Like up tempo. What up, everybody? It's your boy S G F L. We back with another one. You dig? And tonight, man, we got Professor Filch up next. I right, Professor Filch hit me up. It was like S G. I want you to check out some music, share it with your conglomerate with the S G F L family. Let me know what you think, man. Catch a vibe. Catch a bop. All right. So as always, man, everything you want to know about Professor Filch. If you want to know more, you want to get some more in tune with him. Link will be in the description. Professorfilch.com. Okay. Got everything you need to know. All the YouTube, Instagram, Amazon Music, Spotify, Tidal, SoundCloud, Desert, YouTube Music Bank, everything. Professorfilch.com. I right, and also so I happen to check out Professor Filch's website and it gave us a quick little backstory. It says Professor Filch is not a professor. Aha. Uh -huh. Neither at day nor at night. Professor Filch is a band that happens to have only one member. Now, one could argue that artist is more appropriate term here, understandable. But the professor insists that uh, he is a band. Guitar, bass, drums, synths, no vocals. Professor Filch is making music, sometimes fast, sometimes slow. Always full of life and hope and kicking clouds, favorite places, childhood memories, good times. Maybe music is an understatement here. Professor Filch is painting landscapes. I like that. Never trying to fit into the algorithm. Always trying to fit into your hearts. That is a bar right there. Professor Filch, I see you. So we're going to take a listen to this real quick, man. Um, as always, make sure you guys uh, like, share, comment, or subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Do any of that thing. You know, it just helps YouTube to say, hey, SG's doing this thing. Thumb it up. SG need to do better. Thumb it down. All right. And if you really rock with your boy, hit that sub. But let's check out Professor Filch. And the song is called Dance of Those Little Fairies. You can find that done in the back of your garden. That is the entire name. Longest name I think I've seen in music. But let's take a bop. Let's get it. Alright, and with no vocals, alright, so we're gonna get just music only. Music gonna be a lot of instruments, I'm guessing. Okay. Oh yeah, he's taking us on a ride. Probably we back up being a we in a bar right now. Sketch room. And Professor Fish doing all his bad self. I can see it right now, just putting everything together. I feel like I need to be walking down like a, a, a dark alley in like Batman and Gotham right now. <laughs> I wonder if he's doing everything by himself or if he's doing them all at once and then just like mashing it together, you know what I'm saying? It says band camp, so you probably know everything yourself. It's like I'm an 80s cop right now. <laughs> Fairies flying in the backyard doing their little thing, going about their little lives. Ooh. It's getting nighttime, fairies, is, you know, about to get active. It's that synth, man, that slow down synth. Electric guitars are best. Like anybody play instruments, I salute them. That's, you know, Miss Talent. These are the talented people you find in like Guitar Center. All the guys stuff who'd be sitting in the back with a stuff on display and just display it and they try it out and just like put on a show for you for free. I like the, so, the, so many different mixes of music in here, man. Like up tempo, down tempo, or slow tempo, you know. Beats per minute is going up and down, you know what I'm saying? Just getting a good spin on it. It's all flushed together. 
with this ambient background noise right now. It's like, you know, nighttime, you put a camera or a microphone outside, you just hear the crickets and stuff like that. That dead air sound. That's crazy. I like it. I like it. It's a bop. All right, that was Professor Filch with, let me get this right, dance of those little fairies you can find at dawn in the back of your garden. You know what I'm saying? They say like if they got their own little music, their own little theme song that they just bop around to and just do their little fairy, little mag magical, mythical thing. You know what I'm saying? That's what the soundtrack could be. It felt like I should have been like taking a stroll down like 80s, 70s, 80s New York, you know, like around that time with that. It's like it's a nice little boom bap type music man just like a vibe that's i guarantee that's the live sound you hear inside these bars you know when you got like a live band that comes in and just like puts on entertainment for the patrons of the night you know what i'm saying i'm sure in your local city state town province you know exactly what i'm talking about with live music that's what you hear you only know vocals just let them go up there and bring the instruments and rock out catch a vibe good ambient noise man you know what i'm saying where you can have a conversation with somebody it's not overbearing and overdrawn with somebody screaming uh trying to hit high notes in your ears that you're trying to talk to your friends or other patrons and or a little lady friend you're trying to know schmooze over or whatever like that that's that type common background ambient music man that just has a place in any type of like someone's library that's music you can just set up go about doing chores clean the house sit back just decompress you know what i'm saying let your mind just wander a little bit take you to some fantasy place close your eyes let your imagination take over that is this type of music man and it has a place i feel like in everybody's um category or everybody's catalog you should always have music that you don't really need vocals for you just need somebody to put on and you can have it in the background and it can be like almost like a theme song for your day or what have you I, I i mean i'm real big into instrumentals i love that kind of instrument i love lo-fi y'all know y'all been with me on this channel we got over almost approaching 600 videos man y'all y'all got an idea of what i like and y'all know i love lo-fi i love music i love just like instrumentals of nice beats because it takes my brain into a certain aspect and i can close my eyes and i can picture what's going on especially the end of this song with what phil's did man the end of this song how he had that ambient noise of like outside that outdoors you know we all been outside you know what I mean? You just be quiet and you hear the crickets chirping and, you know, slight the bugs and like the, maybe by a lake, you hear the frogs riveting and all that kind of stuff. It's like real, it's serene, it's peaceful, it's calming. I love it, man. I love it. Anybody who play instruments, man, I, I, I congratulate you because you have started or you have uh, kick-started, I should say, a lot of musicians way to come way after you you know what i'm saying because without instruments we wouldn't have music you know in nine times out of ten so the ones who still it's like a um it's like having a uh a, a skill or a trait you know like a trade skill playing music playing an instrument it's like yeah it's a, it's a perishable trait so you always want to make sure you stay up on it because you can't forget but those who do it and take it seriously i commend you because like i said you are the four founders of music to me in my little definition. It was Professor Filch again. Dance to those little fairies you can find at dawn in the back of your garden. Everything you want to know about Professor Filch will be in the description below. Make sure you check out his website, check out his music, check out his catalog, man. Do yourself a favor, have a getaway, um, stimulate your mind with this one. All right. Till next time, we'll be soon. It's your boy, it's JFL, and I am out.